The beat I'm about to show you in today's video was inspired by Drake's Nice For What. Here we go. What's up everybody? Chris Punsalon here, back with another video. In today's video, I'm gonna show you how I made a beat inspired by Drake's song called Nice For What. And spoiler alert, the beat did not come out how I wanted it to, um, but I figured I should show you guys anyways, so you can see my process. Uh, maybe you guys will find this entertaining. So first I played the original song and then I tapped out the tempo. Then I started to build a similar drum pattern. Just need to get that first. Then once I got the drums, the sample idea came up. Oh, hold on. I just thought of something. Brought it into Ableton and started time warping the parts that I liked. And if you're not familiar with time warping in Ableton, it's basically just taking a file, placing warp markers on it, shrinking it or stretching it, getting it in time with Ableton. That way, if you change the tempo, um, if you go up or down, the sample will change with it. And it will always be in time with Ableton. Sometimes, you just gotta see what happens. And sometimes you gotta try stuff and see if it works, and that didn't work. <laughs> After finding the vocals that I liked, I chopped it up on the push and started playing around with the sample chops. And then I give up. I'm throwing in the towel. I'm throwing it in. I'm throwing it in. I'm throwing it in. I'm done. And here's how the beat came out. So like I said in the beginning, I didn't really like how the beat came out, but I wanted to show you guys anyways so you could see what my process is like. And something that I'm, I'm working on every day is knowing when to throw in the towel on a beat and just starting a new one. Um, sometimes I can get caught in the, like this, this crazy zone where I'm making something and I don't even really like what I'm making, but I'm so stuck in the zone that I just wanna keep going to see if I can make it better and then like an hour or two hours will go by and then I'll have a beat that I don't really like when I could have just started a new idea, started something fresh. That's gonna conclude this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. As for the question of the day, do you guys enjoy sampling 
or do you enjoy making your own melodies? Which one do you prefer? Leave your answer down in the comments below and also leave your IG or Twitter handle somewhere in the comment. That way I can reach out to you if you won today's video giveaway. New sample pack on the website, chrispunsalon.com, titled Produce. Go check that out, link in the description for that. And um, that's all I got for you guys today. If you have any suggestions or feedback for this video, please leave it down, whoa. Please leave it down in the comments below. I will be responding to every single person, unless it's spam. Thank you guys for paying attention. Please pay your producers, and I'll see everybody in the next video. If you're not familiar. Ah, blah, blah, blah. brought it into Ableton and started familiar. Brought it into Ableton. Ugh. Brought it into Ableton and started.